Well, I'm up here in the sunroof, clearing some snow off my solar panels. Uh, the temperature finally raised. It's around five degrees, minus five degrees Celsius now, which I'm very happy about. So, a good Sunday morning. I guess we have a new snowstorm coming up today, apparently. Well, it's turned into full white out conditions. Uh, I can barely see the road in front of my, me, so I'm driving very slowly. There's also a lot of uh, snow drift getting into the road, so like here. <laughs> so it's kind of crazy conditions now. Very difficult. Can barely see the road through here. Wow, this is some of the most uh, difficult driving conditions I've ever had. It's uh, slippery and there's snow drift and the visibility is really poor. So I'm just uh, uh, following the, the plowing sticks along the road here. But um, there's no traffic. Only one I met is, uh, is the plowing tractor. So, 
if it gets too difficult I just have to pull over somewhere and wait for the plowing tractor to return. Kind of exciting though, going from minus 29 degrees Celsius and over to this full-on snowstorm here. I didn't expect this within 24 hours. Adventure. I love adventures. going over a mountain pass now as well and I can barely see a hand in front of me but it's working so far looks like the plow has been here quite recently so it's just really difficult to see anything in this whiteout so I'm going very slowly catching this in the front window. 
Do I actually have the plow here? <laughs> that is pretty cool. actually just following the plow now and it cleared up a little bit here I hope um, it's going in the same direction that I'm going here at the crossroads we'll see Uh, now it's a little bit clearer over the mountain there. It was pretty nasty I was almost at a point where I wanted to pull over and, and wait to see if the plow would arrive weather. There was another snowplow that I met, so the road should be pretty good for a little while, but it's uh, blowing over really fast now. Uh, I'm going over Bergefjell, and that's a big mountain. And from what I can see on my Google Maps, I'm supposed to go over a pass here, but I'm not really sure about that. Just looks like it on Google Maps. Um, there is one car in front of me that's of course a four-wheel drive SUV and I met the snowplow so it just means that it should be pretty clear I had some trouble uh, getting started in in that uh, crossroads there on the hill uh, when that other snowplow turned off but uh, I made it by good tires I guess so, yeah, I could have backed off like 100 meters back there and, and gotten some speed up the hill, but I managed to just back off like 5 meters.
Well, it's blowing over here already, so yeah, didn't expect this snowstorm here today. Kind of fun, challenging, not really dangerous because it's not that cold and there's snow plows all over and I'm going really slow. So uh, most of the time what can happen is that you drive into the ditch and need to get towed out, which is annoying and a hassle in this kind of weather. Hopefully I can get off this mountain. It should be 19 more kilometers before I'm off the mountain. So <laughs> yeah, enjoy the drive. A lot of challenging van life going on the last week for me. Being a beginner and everything. Not a beginner on snow driving though. I've been doing that for a very, very long time. And I always enjoy it. some adrenaline flowing through my veins. Just complete wide out. Going 40 kilometers an hour now. Getting to the highest point now in second and uh, driving into a new county right here. Crazy. This is just insane. Going from the challenge of the super cold with minus 29 degrees Celsius or minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit. That was just a day ago. And now I'm uh, in this crazy, crazy snowstorm over the mountain here. like the high point is actually going through a tunnel here so through the mountain got a red light in front of me here let's see yeah, and it's probably like a covered tunnel that has a gate. Yep, it's got a gate. Got a red light in front of me here. It's got a gate. And it's opening for me now. And I'm going into the tunnel. So that should help a little bit.
looks like the tunnel is open on this side. There's an actually a van sitting here. I wonder if they're just waiting. Wow, here is a complete whiteout. So I better just get to it and drive through. that car that passed me earlier. There was a van sitting up there. Uh, I don't know why it was just sitting there. It was snowed down. Maybe it was waiting out this weather. And that was probably a smart thing to do right there because uh, it was kind of a parking lot there and uh, uh, definitively close to the tunnel, so uh, definitely a place where the plowing cars would show up from time to time. Probably overnight there as well, but I don't think this storm is gonna last. I think I saw that it was gonna clear by night, but it might have changed. The weather is so unpredictable this year. It just turns into these crazy cold sprees or snowstorms like now and uh, just makes life exciting <laughs> I would say uh, I didn't expect this at all but it's beautiful and it's uh, a lot of fun actually a lot of fun to to challenge some of my winter skills and uh, Driving skill in winter is an important skill because uh, there's so many different uh, difficult conditions to drive in. You know, you have ice, you have ice with rain, you have now, like now, snow and snow drifts and uh, poor sight. And here's another uh, plowing truck. Let's see if we can help him pass. Yeah, I think that should work. I'm always happy to see them. Yeah, I'm gonna let this other car here get past me as well. That wouldn't be my first choice for passing the mountain today. They're probably having fun. I'm having fun. A lot of fun. <laughs> so I, I usually spend my snowstorms in a tent. But this is just as exciting. Just incredible. Look at this scenery now with the snow. Incredible. Well, I'm uh off the mountain. It's two o'clock and it's almost dark because of this heavy snow weather. Uh, I got over the pass and now it's just snowing like crazy and it's so pretty. It's amazingly beautiful. It's like marshmallow country out here. I can barely see anything. So cool. 
only got five kilometers left to uh, the gas station. That is my goal for today, where I'm gonna get some gas or propane gas for my van here. Oh, I love winter. Winter and snow, amazing. Finally a cup of coffee. Well that was an extremely exciting day. Uh, I didn't expect to end up in a full-on whiteout snowstorm over the mountains. But uh, that's the worst snowstorm I've ever driven in. And it was a complete whiteout and it was super exciting, super fun and uh, yeah, just, uh, just good times. So. A lot of snowstorms and cold weather and a lot of exciting weather on this uh, trip so far. We reached February now so it might not get as cold as it has been going forward but the snowstorms are here indeed. So cheers to a great day over the mountains. And also a cheers to all the people driving the snow plows. Good work, everyone. Mm -hmm.